Hi, it's uh, T again, and i uh, here to show you how to use the account creator module for your Sublime Twitter bot. <clears throat> um, Alright, first thing you need to do is to uh, check uh, the settings. Just go to option and settings and uh, set uh, the threads and the delay in seconds. Um, if, if you have death by captcha, you can set it here. Uh, just click use death by captcha and uh, type in your user username and password. Um, but for this example, I will not be using those. Um, and then go to proxies and uh, you can uh, load the proxies from the file. Okay. So this load those. After you have loaded the proxies, you will also need to load the uh, uh, the database for the names. Um, it's just a text file with uh, with a list of names, um, one name for each line. So let's just load those. Okay. I'm using the same uh, text file for the first name and last name. Uh, you can use uh, different text files and um, set the username format. So, for me, I like it to have a first name and then a random number and a last name. Okay. Just hit on save. All right. Once that's set, you can go to Windows and go to uh, Twitter account creator module. All right. <clears throat> oh, got to uh, tell you that uh, going back to the settings, you can also load a, a list of emails if you want to. Create um, to create um, account email verified accounts, so you can load the list of emails here. Okay, but for this example, I'll just be generating random emails. I'll set it to ten, so it will create ten ra random emails, and uh, so there will be ten accounts. Everything's ready, just click on start. And we can go to the log window. And we'll see what uh, what the software is doing. So just give it time. Okay, and then just type in captures. And all the results will be uh, on this window. Let's just give it a few more, a few more seconds. Uh, we'll have errors. Um, uh, you can see it in the uh, log window. Most of the time, it will be successful. So right now, um, the software is stopped and it has created six accounts. What I can do is uh, I can save it, save the details. Um, I can export it to a text file. Uh, username, email, and password. Or uh, I can just export the username and password or the email and password. Also, we can go to options and settings, and just go to account settings, and just import the accounts from the account creator. And there, just hit on save. And that's it.